friends today we will learn some interesting facts about counting in groups through examples what are you doing with so many tops over here i am playing with them bunny can you guess and tell me that how many tops are there there are two i two four groups that means there are four tops in total no there are groups of five tops each means there are total 20 tops oh yes i don't have to tell how many groups are there but i have to tell how many tops are there in total honey do you understand that we don't have to count the groups of 5 every time if we know the total number of items in one group then we can find out the total number of items in different groups yes i have understood it very well come on honey now you tell me how many marbles are there in each box hmm there are 5 and 5 10 marbles in each box now try to guess how many marbles are there in total each box has 10 marbles and if there are three such boxes the total number of marbles is 30 now look there are 15 marbles here so how many such boxes can we fill with 15 marbles in one box we will fill 5 and 5 10 marbles and in the second box we will fill only 5 marbles this is why it will not be completely full so with 15 marbles we can completely fill one box well done Now tell me what is the total number of marbles here? Here we have ten and ten, twenty, twenty and ten, thirty, thirty and ten, forty, forty and five, forty-five marbles in total. Well done, honey. Listen, day after tomorrow we are celebrating my sister's birthday party. So you both have to come over there. Yes, Bunty, we will surely come. Yes, Bunty, we will surely come. Bye, bye. Friends, today we saw some examples of counting in groups. In the next video, let us meet at Bunty and his sister Bubbly's birthday party. There we will learn the sequence of numbers. Thank <laughs> you.